a guide to customs procedures for importing electronics from the Netherlands. Welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we will be diving into the customs procedures involved in importing electronics from the Netherlands. It is crucial to understand these procedures to navigate the complexities of international trade and ensure a seamless importation process. So, let's get started. Customs brokerage plays a vital role in the importation process. A customs broker acts as an intermediary between the importer and the government agencies involved in customs clearance. They possess expertise in customs laws, regulations, and documentation requirements. Hiring a customs broker can significantly simplify the import process and help avoid potential delays or penalties. When importing goods into the United States, it is necessary to have a customs bond in place. A customs bond is a contract between the importer, the surety company, and the Customs and Border Protection CBP, agency. It guarantees that the importer will fulfill all obligations, including payment of duties, taxes, and compliance with customs regulations. A customs broker can assist in obtaining a customs bond tailored to your specific import needs. The Importer Security Filing ISF, is an important requirement for imports into the United States. It mandates that importers submit specific information about the cargo being shipped to CBP at least 24 hours prior to vessel departure. This filing helps enhance supply chain security and facilitates risk assessment by CBP. Proper document preparation is crucial to avoid delays and ensure compliance. Some essential documents include commercial invoices, bills of lading or airway bills, packing lists, and certificates of origin. It is important to accurately complete these documents, ensuring they contain all the necessary information. Once prepared, these documents should be submitted to the customs broker for review and submission to the appropriate authorities. When importing electronics from the Netherlands, an important consideration is the payment of customs duties and taxes. Customs duties are imposed on imported goods and are calculated based on the value, quantity, and classification of the products. Additionally, taxes such as goods and services tax (GST) or value-added tax (VAT) may also apply. It is important to work with your customs broker to accurately calculate and pay these fees to avoid any issues during customs clearance. After all the necessary documents have been submitted and duties paid, the customs officials will examine the imported goods. This examination may involve physical inspections, X-ray scans, or other verification methods to ensure compliance with regulations. Once the goods have been deemed compliant, Customs will release them for onward transportation to their final destination. And there you have it. A comprehensive guide to the customs procedures involved in importing electronics from the Netherlands. By understanding customs brokerage, customs bond requirements, the importer security filing, ISF, document preparation, customs duties and taxes, as well as the customs examination and release process, you will be well equipped to navigate the complexities of international trade. Thank you for watching this video. If you found it helpful, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more informative videos like this one. Stay tuned for our upcoming videos, where we'll be discussing various aspects of international trade. Video disclaimer below. Until then, Happy importing!